If I want to create a, a graphic from a particular region on my design, what I can do is use a slice. And you can create a slice by using the slice tool. Uh, and we'll look at that now. The slice tool is available in the export persona. So if I just come over to the top left here and choose export persona there, you'll see the tool sets change. And this first icon here, the selected one, is the slice tool itself. So uh, what we can do is then just drag across a particular region or area on the page and we're drawing out the size of the slice we want. When we release the mouse button we'll have a slice which in this case is uh, of a dimension 519 by 115 pixel and its default name is slice 1 and the export options format would be PNG color space of RGB and a bit depth of 8. So first of all, because I've drawn that by hand, I can actually change those dimensions to be more accurate. So coming down in the transform, pa transform panel in the bottom right, I can change this to be a more accurate 500 pixel wide and a height of 100. Now one of, once I've got that sized, I can move that around just by panning or, or repositioning rather the slice on the page. You see that uh, green vertical line there, that indicates that it's perfectly centered. So now I want to uh, consider my export options here. Now what I can do is I can change from that default 24-bit PNG which we saw on the title bar to something different and you'll see that change. So if I want a JPEG you can see it changed to JPEG. Uh, if I wanted uh, another format, a TIFF RGB, you can see that changes. But we'll go back and we'll just go back and have the PNG 24-bit option selected. When I was drawing out that slice on the page, it created a, a slice entry. And it's a slice 1 entry you can see here. Now this can be renamed. I can just call it quad. We can change... Uh, the export preset format from single PNG, which is um, a non-retina version, to uh, the non-retina version plus a retina version. We'll just expand that, you'll see that there. So there is the single PNG and this is the times two retina PNG uh, proposed to be created uh, from the slide. So you would end up with two files, uh, one called quad PNG and one called quad at 2x.png. To export both files, I can just simply click this button here, or I can click an individual file just to get the retina version or the non-retina version. So I'll just click this button here, and in this folder, which I've already created called exported, I can choose export, and the two files will export into there. And there the files are there.